everybody, my name is Chrissy, and I just came to talk about an experience that I had last night at a restaurant that I will leave unnamed. So last night I was going out to dinner with my friend, and afterwards we were going to the movies. So we did call ahead seating, we arrived at the restaurant with plenty of time. When we got our little buzzer thing, we were told it would be about 15 minutes. But as sometimes happens to people, we got to chatting and it was like almost 45 minutes later when we realized we had not been called yet. So we went up to the hostess stand and said, hey, we've been here like 45 minutes, she told us 15 minutes. And you could tell by how she was looking at the screen that something wasn't quite right. And But all she said was that it would be another five minutes and handed us back our buzzer. And so we both kind of shuffled over a few steps away and, and waited and waited another 10 minutes, during which we both discussed that we felt like there was something not quite right going on. So after about 10 minutes, I went up to the hostess again, said, uh, you're next up, it should just be another minute. And I reminded her, Mike, we've been here almost an hour now waiting. And she said, I know. So um, right as I walked back to my friend, she calls us over and says, your table's ready. And so we got escorted to a table and in the interest of not causing a scene at the front of the restaurant, um, we decided that when we got seated to just ask for the manager. The manager came over, we explained what happened, that we'd done call head seating. We were told 15 minutes and we really waited almost an hour. And he had actually already looked at our reservation and knew something quite wasn't quite right. And we said also our other concern was that the waitress, the hostess, was didn't was dishonest about what had happened and so he went back and he got the whole story of what happened and there was a mix up with our reservation and, and another reservation and we ended up that that's basically what happened and so he apologized he gave us a free appetizer and he gave us um fifteen dollars off of our dinner so um, we probably paid about half of what it actually cost for us to eat there but as we sat there talking about it the biggest thing that sort of hit home to me was that this hostess, you know, she made a mistake. It happens to all of us. And instead of saying, you know, I'm sorry, there was a mistake. I'll put you up next for the next table. She kind of was dishonest about what happened. And that left a bad taste in our mouth. And I'm sure that was understood by our manager that we spoke to. But that put a lot of pressure on the rest of her staff from her manager um, at the hostess stand who was sitting right there right next to her and didn't know that this problem had come up to the manager of the restaurant to the kitchen staff the waitress who now had to rush our food so we can make our dinner reservation and it was just such a little thing that I'm sure in her head it was like oh I'll just I'll just put them next and kind of be like oh no you know kind of brush it off like it's nothing but in reality, what she did was she brushed off an obvious mistake and caused this ripple effect to everybody else. So just, I think it's a good lesson in sort of being honest. You know, we all make mistakes. If when we fess up to them, it usually goes so much better for us. People are understanding of mistakes. It's when we try to sort of make them into something that they're not to minimize the damage that we think is going to happen. You know what? So sometimes we're embarrassed we made make a mistake and you know what? I think people appreciate that embarrassment more than the dishonesty about the mistake. So that's your lesson for today. Be honest and be good and uh, thanks for listening and watching. Thanks. Bye.